Yeah, I just want to put a word of caution out about the uh, Spooky 2 generator. Um, now, I don't sell these things. I just got a few of them. I've been using them about 24 hours a day, 7 days a week for about a year now. And I personally had no problem with them, right? That's Rocky the Cat over here, by the way. That's his, that's his glamour shot. But um, uh, I heard there's a few people that did have a problem with the generators. Um, not many. And I, from what I've heard... Like I said, I'm not a representative or a salesman on this, but from what I've heard, they resolved the problems of all the customers that did have a problem with a few that did. But here's the real rationale why you probably have a problem is you got a USB uh, connection down here and you got the power. This has to be powered in by, um, you know, the power from uh, the wall socket or your... Um, you know your your uh, battery backup power strip or something like that. It has to be powered up from the 115 volt household current, and not just from the USB. This generator can turn on physically just from the USB connection here on a computer. So, for instance, if the electricity goes out or you're accidentally turn off the power by knocking the cord or something from the power into the wall outlet the generator will still be on but that is not good for a certain chip that's inside of it and that is likely been the problem with a few of these where they had a problem with because it'll burn up a certain chip that's in there now what they're going to do in the future is they're, you know, they're going to put this big, I know it's uh, it's in the instructions not to do that. You must power it by the power cord. You can't be powering it by the USB. The USB is only to send the signal from the program itself, the program. It's not to power the device. That is, will hurt the device after a while, but it doesn't like break the whole thing. It breaks one little chip. And current, the older models have a chip that can be replaced I forget I don't know what it costs but I never had a problem with it. I've been using this 24 hours a day seven days a week for a year now and it's not giving me a problem but almost a year they're constantly on and they're accurate and I, I can't I don't see any frequency generators this cheap for this accurate that work with this program not alone work with this program so my personal opinion is a great deal but some people had a problem and I heard they resolved the problems of anybody, the few people that had problems, right? Even if it wasn't, you know, the fault of the generator. But most of the time, they had a, the ones, the few that did have a problem was because the power cord um, was, the power got turned off in the power cord. The unit looks like it's still on. And because it's being powered by the USB, and it's not supposed to be powered by the USB. It's supposed to only get the signal from the program from the USB. So what they got now in the future though is they're going to have a big warning tag on it about that besides having an instructions but the chip that can possibly get damaged by say for instance you have this in your laptop and you know the laptop has a battery in it so if you got it plugged in the, in the cord here in the, you know the USB here and say your electricity goes out in the house when you're gone you have this thing running um, it's not guaranteed it's going to damage the generator, but it's not good for this one chip that's in there. Hi, Putin. <laughs> Thanks for stopping by. The um, <laughs> the one thing, though, they're going to have it where you can, it's going to be a plug-in device where you can just buy the chip, very in, that one chip that can possibly be damaged inexpensively. And um, uh, get off my computer here, buddy. <laughs> That's the cat. He's uh, he's jumping around on a computer here. So anyway, uh, <laughs> see, that's him. He's operating spook. This guy, he always wants to help. No matter what I'm doing, he wants to help. You want to be running spooky? What are you looking at over there, buddy? Are you examining what the frequencies are? Anyway, I didn't rehearse this. This cat has got his mind of his own, okay? So um, anyway, if the <laughs> if the thing gives you a problem like that chip breaks or something because you know the power went off and you had the USB plugged in your laptop for so many hours that doesn't necessarily mean it's going to break it but if it does they're going to have it so you can buy the chip itself only 
inexpensively and you just plug they're gonna have it as a plug-in not even a solder in but here you go so these people are okay I mean I think they're okay I don't know who the hell they are but I think they're okay I'm not a salesman I don't freaking sell this stuff I don't have no financial connection to them I'm you I'm an end user I think it's a good deal and Mr. Cat thinks it's, you see these are my these are my mice these are my uh, little Ferrari mice right right buddy hi when they squint like that, that means they're affectionate. Anyway, oh, by the way, <laughs> I don't know what kind of video this is, but I'll, I'll, I'm going to show you Goldie. Goldie, if you remember who the hell Goldie is, see how big he's getting? He's like, ooh, that's boom. You hear that boom? You heard a boom. That's New Year's Eve boom. Anyway, so <laughs> he's running by the cat food. Where are you going? Anyway, <laughs> so Goldie's getting big. He's still a kitten, but he's getting big. And I uh, just want to put this out here as the people that have this spooky thing, the spooky two device, they're not screwed up. They're, I think they're real honest, man. So they're offering it very cheap. And, um, you know, any problems they run into, they're trying to resolve right away, keep everybody happy and blah, blah, blah. And Yeah, and it could be possible if you have it plugged in by the USB device that you will, um, I mean, what the hell you call it, um, <laughs> messing up the uh, generator by you know if the power goes off in the house and you have it plugged in on a laptop right but a USB because the laptop battery will keep it powered to the generator for I don't know how long you know maybe a couple hours or more maybe longer than that and I don't know if that would hurt the generator that might that might so if, there, if that happens though like I said the new ones are going to have uh, a little plug-in chip just buy a replacement plug-in chip for cheap and just plug it in. You're all set to go. So, anyway, right, buddy. Thanks for running spooky, Putin. <laughs> and you're a funny cat. You know that? You know that? I think you're getting too smart because I've been giving you um, extra freaking uh, good food with green foods and running spooky on you and uh, uh, bio north neg magnetic negative field. So uh, you're getting to be pretty damn smart. You probably understand what I'm telling you, right? Just that you can't say it. Tell me what you're saying. You know, you don't talk English. You're a smart cat, buddy. Anyway, over and out.